What is good guys and welcome back. Now you're like, where is the face cam? Well, to be honest, um, my camera, you know what I'm saying, kind of broke. Well, it didn't really break, it just kind of, something went wrong with it. So it's at the store right now. So I will have a gameplay later when my camera is fixed. It should pick it up around like four o'clock. And right now for me, it's, uh, hold on, look at the, it's 12.30. So I'm gonna do this video first and then I'm gonna have a gameplay with the face cam later on today when I get my camera back. Uh, but for now, we're going to draft, we're going to do the glitch, we're going to see how high of an overall team we can get. So let's check it out here, and we're just going to go straight into it. Try to get players that I know can get us to like a 90, 91 overall draft with the glitch. Now, if you guys don't know about the glitch, well, just, just watch this. I'll put the link to one of my other videos in the description so you guys can see it. Um, but yes, it's very important that you get the right players so that the players can be multiplied um and you can get a very high overall now you guys see so far it is not looking like something i want i know i turned down the safety but you will see why i turned down that safety if i get the right cards if i didn't get the right cards when this draft is over it's gonna look stupid why i didn't pick that safety but so far so good this is something that I need. You need good offensive linemen. You need a good middle linebacker, good outside linebackers. You need a very good cornerback, just like I have right here in Justin Gilbert. Uh, maybe even a dominant safety. I'm talking about a safety that's, you know, um, 95 or above. Anything 95 or above, basically. Oh, it's clutch, and this is very, very good. I'll get Kyle Rudolph, though. You see why I'm gonna get Kyle Rudolph in just a bit. Round nine is okay, okay. Ronald Darby will get you. If I can get a beast middle linebacker, it will be a wrap. Now you guys say, wow, this guy is good. Well, he is, but I feel like I can get a better middle linebacker than him, so I'm gonna just take the risk of not getting him. And so far, this draft is amazing. Melvin Gordon, we will select you. Where are my receivers, though? Where are my... Re okay, we got one, but I'm going to go and I'm going to select the left tackle. Anthony... Uh, what is that? Moon... Moonos. Moonos. Uh, yeah, I got to go with the left end and Vic Beasley Jr. Two rounds left. Oh, gosh. Actually, that's fine. Two rounds left. Receiver. All right, this is terrible. I ain't even going to lie. This is terrible. One round left. Receiver. Okay, we get Odell Beckham. Perfect. 87 overall draft with this Odell Beckham. I mean, it could have been a bit better if I got one more uh, receiver or even a middle linebacker. But I'll show you what the overall will be with the glitch at the end. All right, so for this draft, the first one, you guys, you see, we went from an 87 to an 89. Couldn't really do much on offense. We did get Kyle Rudolph to the fullback position who helped us get up just a little bit, maybe even like half an overall. Didn't really do much, but the defense is where it made most of the difference. Now you guys see outside linebackers can be very, very effective with the glitch. Uh, you guys see he's at the right end here. He's at the right outside linebacker, the left outside linebacker. I mean, I even put him at the left end if I wanted to, but it's all right. I'll put him there. We got free safety, strong safety, Earl Thomas. We have very good cornerbacks. Earl Thomas also playing the third cornerback position. So I'm gonna draft again, 89 overall draft. Let's see if we can crack that 90. Okay, so we're gonna start with Pete Carroll. Get the best coach, get the best coach. Everybody always says to do that. Now round one. Oh, that is what I like to see. 95 overall Phillip Rivers, that gives me confidence. Oh my gosh. That does give me confidence that we're gonna get a very, very good draft and we're getting high overalls, 95 and 95. And then here we go with another good pickup in Brandon Williams. So that's three elite rounds in a row of very good elites. Right tackle, gotta get the right tackle. 86 overall, it wasn't an elite round, but he was the best player on the board right there. Now Chris Long, a middle linebacker, or we'll go with the 83 overall cornerback, why not? We at least need two cornerbacks. As you, oh my gosh, and here we go. Dante Hightower doesn't even play for them anymore. I think he went to the Browns, I believe. Uh, I, I believe. I'm not exactly sure, but I'm pretty sure he did. But that is exactly what we need. A beast middle linebacker. This could be the, oh my gosh, the draft. This could be it that will get us over that 90 or even the 90 overall. Very, very excited so far. And why are they giving us such bad cards? They're gonna give me a good one, then a bad one. Just give me good cards only. You know what I'm saying? Give me good cards only. Should I get Vernon? 
Nah, I'll go get another left, or not left tackle, but offensive lineman. So, so far, so good. And oh my goodness, they want us to succeed. They want us to win. And I'll go with another offensive lineman. Now it is time for us to turn it up right here and get some very good players. Orlando Skandrick, will he help us out? Yes, he will. Another cornerback for us. Uh, I need receivers, two safeties. I need a tight end. Who do I get? I'll go with Tyrell Williams. But I need some more players to help me out. Okay. Okay. Curse. Two players left. Two rounds left. Running back. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Free safety. Yeah, I'll have to go with the free safety. And then this round has to get us to an 87. It is mandatory that it does. And it will not. It will not. I got to figure out, though, what I'm going to do. Okay. Oh, actually, you know what? It might be a very good draft. Now, look at it. 86 overall. Remember that. This could still get to a 90. 86 defense, 86 offense. I'll show you what it is after I make some adjustments. Okay, guys. So, we were very close. Once again, 89. This time, we jumped three overalls. I got to get this 90. I'm going to try again. Uh, hopefully, we can do it. Now, I need to get some better offensive players that can help me out. But the defense right here was perfect. The middle linebacking position is what saves us in a very good cornerback. You need a very good middle linebacker, a very good cornerback, and a very good either left end or right end. And that saves you a lot for the defense. And the offense, it's just going to really be offensive line, good receiver, good quarterback, good tight end. And that's really all you need. So we are quickly going to move through this round. Hopefully, we can get some type of draft like we got last time. It was what we needed. Very good overall players, but this one's already starting off kind of low compared to the 95s that we got last time. But I still have faith, man. Still have faith, and here we go. That is what I like to see. And this man right here, Willie McGinnis, will save us a lot. Now, if we can get also a 95 or above uh, middle linebacker, our defense will be set. If we also get a 95 or above cornerback. So there's a lot of things that we are hoping for. Um, but, you know... Hoping isn't too bad. It isn't too bad. You have to have faith at least. You at least have to have faith. And so far, I have a little bit. They are giving us good players. Very good elites, but not in the right positions. Look at this right tackle in 94. I wish that was like a middle linebacker, a cornerback, something like that. Something along those lines. You guys see already now we're getting these 83 overall cards, which I do not want at all. And finally, we get like a center. In the last two drafts, I have not actually, you know what? The last like four drafts, I haven't got a center. All right, so now it's getting a little more complicated because I do. You know what? I'm going to take Will Compton. Hopefully, he does a good job for us at the left outside linebacking position. I might not even need him, to be honest. All right, I'll take Jesse James because I can put him at a uh, fullback if I have to. We are only at an 84 overall, guys. We need to get bumped up to an 85 right now at this round 12. Okay, good. So we're stuck at this 84 right now. Uh, cornerbacks are important, but so are receivers. I don't even have one receiver yet. And I've noticed that I have not been getting a lot of good receivers. Oh my gosh. Right when I said I need a middle line, I get one. Will Compton, very good pickup for us. I do need a wide receiver. Antonio Freeman joined the team. Join the team, round 14. Oh, oh, perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, I do need a left end. Uh, and it is Michael Strahan, that man is a beast. Now, can we get an 87 right here? Oh, oh my goodness. This could be perfect, Darius Slay. All right, 87 overall, this could be the draft. I know I always say that. But we're only three away right here. Last time we had a draft like this, I was 86. I got to an 89. This could be it. Once again, guys, oh my gosh. The defense makes the most of the impact, as usual. But I'm so close. If this was Tuesday, I would have got a 91 or a 92. But it's not. It's Friday. So hopefully, I don't know, man. I might do it again this weekend. If you guys do want to see it again, hit the thumbs up. And I'll do it as many times until I get a 90 or above overall. And I will post that one for you guys. But once again, hope you guys enjoy. Enjoy your weekend as well. It's a very nice day outside where I am. Hopefully it is for you guys as well. Have fun. 
with your friends and family, do your homework too. You might as well do it today, get it out the way. So on, you know what I'm saying, Saturday and Sunday, you can turn up, turn up as in like go outside and play football or soccer or basketball, whatever you do. Uh, but yeah, we guys enjoyed one more time. New people, new subscribers. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Hit the thumbs up button and also comment down below if you are new so I can welcome you to the family and we could all welcome you as well. Stay tuned, guys. And for now, you already know your boy is out.